Maybe a little girl from West Philadelphia. She's got some pretty impressive skills that have earned the respect of some huge celebrities. Fox 29's Stephanie Esposito introduces us to this young tech wizard. Zora Ball is seven years old. She's a ballerina, likes to get her nails done, and... She's the youngest person to ever code a video game. What does minus Y20 mean? 20 means the speed. The West Philadelphia first grader was introduced to a program called Bootstrap by one of her teachers at the Harambe Charter School. You know, again, just wanting to push the envelope and uh, do something different um, and, and then really uh, just see if she could actually grasp the concept. I had to do a lot of math. Zora joined a Saturday class with fifth and sixth graders. Her teacher, Baba Tariq Nazir, taught them a very simplified way to code. After 10 weeks of classes, Zora came up with this game. Vampire Diamond. They're supposed to get away from the vampire and get the ruby. Word of this phenomenal first grader and her creation made its way across the country and earned her some pretty notable recognition. In this context, there's no disrespect. Former President Clinton and Will I Am. Artist Will I Am heard about Zora's app and flew her, along with her family and teacher, from Philadelphia to California. Zora showed Vampire Diamonds to Will and his charity, the I Am Angel Foundation, which works to improve the way kids learn in school. Zora was able to transform her game to the likeness of Will. Um, and when we introduced that, that was something. Zora was thrilled that Will I Am liked her game, but also noted that he complimented her outfit, too. The first thing that people say is, oh my goodness, he's a first grader. This, this is the future of coding. To play Vampire Diamonds, you have to get a password from Harambe Charter School. But Zora is now working on turning the game into an app that you can download on your phone. So it's coming. It will. Yeah. It yep. will be available. Yep. Zora's teacher says now that she's learned to walk in the world of coding, he can't wait to see how she runs. We know that the end result is the confidence is built and they're able to make a difference. Stephanie S.